with the starboard survey complete, the crew moving the robotic arm so that the end effector camera can be trained on the port side of the upper surface of the orbiter. As the shuttle robotic arm is being maneuvered, this uh, camera providing a nice view of the starboard uh, payload bay door open, uh, exposing the radiator to uh, expel heat uh, from the orbiter. The robotic arm now crossing over Atlantis's payload bay with the P3, P4 truss structure, the 35,000 pound uh, truss on its way to be installed on the outboard port side of the International Space Station to add another set of solar array wings that provide a power generation capability by collecting the sunlight and uh, powering equipment on the station. This uh, survey, when it is complete, will end the inspections of the thermal protection system for today uh, with all the information being sent down to Mission Control for engineers to analyze and to confirm the integrity of Atlantis's heat shield. The crew uh, will also work on setting up for rendezvous and docking to the International Space Station. The remaining tasks for today to prep for that docking tomorrow include installing the centerline camera that uh, is scheduled to be done by Commander Brent Jett and Mission Specialist Joe Tanner. That camera will provide Jett a uh, straight on view to the uh, docking mechanism at the International Space Station tomorrow. After installing the centerline camera, Tanner and Mission Specialist Steve McLean scheduled to install the orbiter docking system, actually extending the ring of the orbiter docking system that uh, will make contact with the station and secure the two vehicles together. And astronaut Jeff Williams uh, queuing up a video to show inside the U.S. Destiny Laboratory module to uh, show how the uh, area has been situated and prepared for the six crew members from the Space Shuttle Atlantis uh, to arrive tomorrow. Obviously, the forward hatch and the bib smooths are ready to go. I'm going to deploy one to the RWS this evening. Uh, there's the CWCs and the mesh bag, and to the left you saw a, the bag with the ingress equipment. And uh, here's all the prepack stuff. Um, there's also prepack stuff. I think I forgot to pan up on uh, port one. Yeah, you just caught a glimpse of the port one. But that gives you the, the forward end cone configuration, at least the primary stuff. And uh, here, this is uh, CTB with the foam inside for the DDCU after uh, whatever it is, EVA 2 or 3. So it's uh, pre-positioned for when that comes in from EVA. Going into the airlock, we got the two safers, uh, 1003 and 1005 deployed. I'm assuming 1003 is for EV1 and 1005 is for EV2. So I've got them set up with their tools uh, configured that way as well. There's still a little bit of foam in deck one, which will be gone before they get here. That's 1003 right there with uh, Joe's tools. You can see access to the PBA and the uh, fire extinguisher. 
There's the 30 of you that uh, will not be used, and then the far two for uh, for Heidi. I'm sorry for uh, Steve and uh, Dan. Of course, this is the spare here. And for EVs three and four, we do have mirrors installed and uh, checklist installed as well. Coming in your lock on the right hand side, lower right hand, you'll see the two uh, mesh bags for batteries and Medox. Let's see, PCS got the headset there. You'll see the handheld mic is hooked up. That's the laptop there for charging batteries. I was going to ask about getting rid of that, but uh, I never got to it. Throwing that away somewhere. There's the two mesh bags, again, with the, for EVA 1 and 2, respectively. And I'm going to get EVA 2s out of there tonight as well, stow it in the node. Jeff, you got about a Look minute Look it up, left. you can see the uh, helmet lights and the one. Okay. I think we'll be done in a minute. Cup. And in the crew lock, we've got uh, the cover for the ORU on the far left. That'll be moved out in the node, too. That's for EVA3. And then the mesh bag for EVA2. And then the two large ORU bags. Right here, I've got the cable for charging uh, Rebus. I want to leave it right there so it's right next to the plug. It's behind the closeout panel. In Atlantis, we're on board. Uh, we have some good video. Thanks. We're waving back.